Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2019 in Budapest, Hungary. We're very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Mr. Petros Galides, who is Deputy Commissioner of Electronic Communications and Postal Regulation for Cyprus. Mr. Galides, welcome to the studio. Glad to be here with you. Now, I'd like to start off by talking about in innovating together, connectivity that, that uh, matters. Is this event's theme? What does it mean to you? Meaningful connectivity, which is the theme of this uh, event means, first of all, connectivity has to be uh, accessible, accessible to all. It needs to be affordable. And after that, it needs to be functional, uh, fit for purpose, and easy to use for users. That's the purpose. To be really meaningful, those need to be complemented by the appropriate digital skills that will complete the picture and make connectivity truly meaningful. Um, through meaningful connectivity, people will be enabled. Um, women, young people, people in remote areas, people with disabilities, everybody will be able to um, contribute improving the standard, the quality of living, um, bringing everybody into the economy and uh, society, thus making connectivity really meaningful. Uh, Let's talk a little bit about 5G. How is uh, uh, 5G going to be deployed in, uh, in, in Cyprus? Okay, well, um, the, uh, our uh, providers are already uh, incorporating uh, the rollout of 5G in their strategic plans. Um, uh, a public consultation has already started and uh, will be completed by the end of uh, this month, hopefully. And probably early 2020, uh, the auction uh, of the spectrum uh, will start. Um, on a grander scale, as, um, as Cyprus, um, we are collaborating very closely with other countries um, and uh, with uh, uh, partnering also uh, private and public sector to bring in the benefits uh, of these very exciting new <laughs> developments uh, to Cyprus as soon as possible. Um, now, the ITU uh, Regional uh, Innovation Forum will take place next year in Cyprus. What will it be its uh, key uh, focus and aims, do you think? Okay, its key focus will be the development of a, an ICT-centric uh, um, uh, world. Um, okay, uh, it's a bit early to go into detail to that, because we're only at the starting point of uh, organizing it. Um, Cyprus, as you probably know, already uh, organized the cyber drill in uh, 2018. European cyber drill, indeed. Yes. And how did that go? What, what, what were the main uh, uh, takeaways from that? Okay, looking back, uh, we think it's been very successful for all involved. Uh, we're talking about more than 200 uh, participants from 15 or so countries. Um, it was very uh, successful and productive. Um, in my mind, the main takeaway was that it's impressive and promising that um, the private sector, organizations from the private sector work so closely with uh, government cybersecurity advisors um, to help ensure we have a secure, cyber world. Uh, those two events, of course, are, are, are indicative of the great, very good collaboration developing between uh, Cyprus and the ITU. Beyond that, we have uh, very good collaboration regarding development, uh, education, uh, standardization, uh, cybersecurity, 
many aspects uh, that we work very closely and uh, productively with the ITU. Great. Well, I also wanted to ask you, what's the value for you of attending events such as ITU Telecom World? Oh, the value is immeasurable. Um, one of the most important things is that um, you get to listen and be exposed to different experiences. That's the most crucial thing. Um, even, even if, you know, most people here are leaders in their fields. One could say they know everything about their field. But uh, listening, even to the same things, even to things they know, uh, to people describing them or looking at them from a different perspective, coming from different experiences, different problems, that even if we think we know everything, other people face problems we could never imagine. The creative solutions they found to them. Um, so all in all, the most important thing, okay, we all learn something new every time, nobody knows everything. Uh, but the most important part is uh, being exposed to the different perspectives. Um, so bringing together people from uh, uh, very diversified backgrounds, different countries, different organizations, um, is the most important aspect. Uh, and I would like to congratulate the ITU and the Secretary General uh, for making this possible and uh, uh, for being a catalyst to bringing people of such diverse background together. Um, uh, for instance, uh, uh, with the Secretary General's initiative, uh, people from uh, Asia and Af Africa came together, met together, together with European countries, so I was there as well. Um, I was exposed to different experiences. I was able to, to meet people and get to know people. Those people might one day refer to me and ask, what have you done with this problem? What do you think? or vice versa. I may end up uh, asking them, I want your perspective, but we're stuck here. <laughs> it was uh, wonderful. That's uh, very useful. Well, thank you very much for joining us in the studio. It's been a great catching up with you here, and um, hopefully as say, you will take back some of these experiences with you, which I'm sure you will, and we'll catch up with you again in the near future. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed.